Fans should really be excited for this game because it combines four different universes together in one game. Each universe has a very distinctive art style, a really distinctive gameplay mechanic, and Spider-Man himself looks and feels different from universe to universe. Each universe will have its own unique gameplay style. In The Amazing Universe, this is a very high, fast-paced, web-based combat. The Amazing Spider-Man uses his webs to make hammers as weapons to use web shots to blind his enemies, and the webs are a very active part of the combat. Whereas the Noir Universe is a new comic series from Marvel, where he's in the 1930s. It's a bit darker, a bit grittier, and the gameplay mechanic is a stealth-based combat style. We've included for the first time in a Spider-Man game um, first-person sequences, and these are basically interactive cutscenes where the player really gets to feel like they've become Spidey. The camera will switch into a first-person perspective, and it's a punch-out style of gameplay where it's interactive and you see yourself actually causing damage to the enemy. The levels are really designed around specific bosses. So everything from the graphic style, the actual environment that the boss is in itself, as well as the minions in the level are really tailored to be in line with who that boss of that level is. The two villains that we're announcing this week are Craven from The Amazing Universe and Hammerhead from The Noir Universe. We're not announcing any of the other villains in the game, but I can promise you that there's a huge cast of characters to come. Spider-Man Shattered Dimensions is releasing in September of 2010 on Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, Nintendo Wii, and Nintendo DS.